Hey what is up guys it is Phantom here and welcome back to the pirate walkthrough everybody where we are continuing our journey in Marleybone as always where we got to go enter the glass house prison in glass house war wardroom okay cool anyways we need to go talk to Catbeard like that is just absolutely imperative to our journey here but anyways welcome back <laughs> welcome back to the walkthrough um let's see what's inside here oh, okay Oh, we got a few, uh... Alright, we're just gonna walk around here. God, dude. I am so... I am so excited to explore the rest of Marley right, Captain. Here we go. I'm going to tell the guard that your colleagues of mine from Port Regal, whom I've asked here to interview the prisoner. Okay. <laughs> yeah, basically, main goal is just to talk to Catbeard. I haven't really done anything, you know, too much in between episodes. There's not really too much to say. Why don't we just hop into the quest line here? Oh, who goes there? Good day to you, Corporal. It's me, Solicitor Swidget, uh, to see Mr. Beard. I've brought along these uh, colleagues of mine from Port Regal. Oh my god, you're so skittish, man. There's Rapbeard with his one promotion. <laughs> They're, uh, experts on the applicable statutes of Port Regal ordinances vis-a-vis -vis Marlebonian common law. I simply cannot do without them. <laughs> what, what did he just do? I, expert, that's us. Not pirates at all. Pipe down, you git. <laughs> well, I suppose your say so is good enough, Mr. Swidget. Go on in. I hope this don't take too long. Prisons make me nervous, Captain. Yeah, Ratbeard. You were honestly pretty close to one at one point or another. Alright, we finally get to talk to Catbeard, though. See if we can get some whereabouts to where he might be keeping this map. Oh, Captain, he looks. Meow, 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 it's you. Thank the stars. Oh, he looks awful. I'm mortified you have to see me in such a sorry state. But with all of this damp, I simply haven't been able to do a thing with my hair. Oh my god, that is. I was wondering. Yikes. Could it be possible for you to do an incy wincy chai pitsy favor for me? Get me out of here. <laughs> You've got to get me out of here. Do you understand? Look at what they're making me wear. Do you know what passes for grooming in this place? I could I could not imagine. Wait, I know why you're here. A certain map piece? Hmm? Now don't worry, it's safe. I'll tell you exactly where it is. If you secure my freedom. Oh my god. How? My solicitor has a plan, and now that you're here, I think it just might work. Swidget has all the juicy details. All right, calm. I am calm. Oh, Captain, it's grand to be working together again. What great fun we'll have. Really enjoying the story so far. Her Majesty has issued an emergency decree. Any qualified sailor may be released uh, on parole into the custody of a captain in the Royal Navy. Hmm. Unfortunately, uh... We haven't been able to find any officer willing to take responsibility for Mr. Beard. His, uh, reputation precedes him. As it would. But the Admiralty will commission any, uh, civilian captain as an irregular captain of the Royal Navy. Hmm. Another emergency decree, you see. Because of the war. Go to the High Command and apply for an emergency commission. They're sure to grant you one. Once you have it, you can take custody of Mr. Beard. Well, all right. Is that going to be too hard to get? I'm not sure. Emergency commission. All right. I think I'm just going to leave a mark here. I feel like we're going to have to come back there pretty soon at some point. Also, almost level 52. That's pretty cool. All right. Let's see. How far do I need to go? Where exactly do I need to go here? Seek an emergency commission in Ad Admiralty Foyer. Hmm. All right. God, dude. I am never going to get tired of Marley Bone and Pirate. I just... Like, this place looks so cool, dude. Oh, it looks so cool. Oh, and I loved Marleybone and Wiz as well. I really did. So this is just, I mean, this is just amazing. Look at this place, dude. It's so grand. God, it's incredible. All right. Captain Aubrey. Hello? Oh, another irregular He's an otter. Applicant, eh? Well, we're not letting in every deckhand who wanders up from the docks. You'll have to prove yourself. Go out and disable an armada fortress. Then you may see the Admiralty board. I guess the other armada fortresses we attack don't count. Best not bring that up, <laughs> considering the results. Yeah, that is kind of... <laughs> that actually is kind of funny, considering we kind of started this war in the first place. 
But, uh, wow. Okay, they're, they're really just like, okay, go. Go and attack an armada fortress. Then you can come back. Alright, well, I guess I'll see you guys there then. Alright, please, please, for the love of God, just let me in the fortress. <laughs> oh my god. So, I actually had to defeat a few ships before I could actually come to the fortress here. And, oh my god. Oh, wait, we actually have to defeat some guards too. Huh. Alright, well, let's do that. But, uh, <laughs> I had to defeat some armada ships before doing this. And holy shit, there are so many ships. There are like, <laughs> there are so many ships, armada ships in the Skyway. It's actually, it's actually just insane. They've, they've completely surrounded the place. My god. Although it's kind of refreshing, I don't know why. Just to like beat up the armada again. Kind of just gives me life on the inside, I suppose. Get him, Barnabas. Yeah. I don't know, man. It's kind of nice just knocking some sense into these metal men. Alright, go off, Barnabas. Kind of insane. His accuracy seems a little low, though. Alright, what do we got for doubloons here? Will doubloon? Ew, get rid of that. Alright, we've got... Ooh, yes, I can do a vicious charge. Let's do that. And Barnabas, you can keep attacking that guy. It's all good. There we go. There's the... Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. I thought we were going to get a cool chain hit, but it's fine. Oh well. Looks like Barnabas is going to steal all of Goronado's thunder this episode. Which, you know, I'm okay with as long as there is some thunder to be had. Do I got any more buffs I can give my guys here? Yeah, I do. Alright, cool. Let's definitely do some Kraken's Coils, and we can do that. Well, as that. And you can go like that. Perfect. Oh, come on. Yes, finish him off. There we go. Hey. That's my boy. Uh-oh. They definitely do a lot of damage, though. There is no doubt about that. Oh. There you go. A little AoE for you. Alright, what's this? I should probably start looking at my doubloons. Like, that would be smart. Tower shield? I mean, I don't really need that right now. Uh, juju. Yeah, this juju only affects me, so we're definitely not going to use that. Alright. Everyone attack the musketeer right now. There you go. Hey, 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 my boys, my boys, getting the chains. He's getting the chains. Oh, come on. Oh, we're so close. Oh, we're so close.
I don't want to jinx it, but we've gotten pretty lucky so far with the enemies not critting. Ah, uh, I probably just jinxed it. It's okay. Honestly, not too worried. I'm pretty, I'm pretty proud of my squad. Call me cocky, but they're my boys. Always and forever. I know Rapyard's also a good Buccaneer companion, but I don't think he really compares to anyone on my squad, or at least right now. I don't know. Maybe you can contend with Barnabas. Jesus, 428. That is insane. Sorry, I didn't know I was buffing the other team. Alright, he's dead. Perfect. Alright, so let's get all this gold. And what do we have to do next? Okay. Oh, jeez. Alright, so it's a dungeon. Haha. <laughs> Sounds good, Rapid. Also, one of the comments was saying to actually move Peter Quint into the first companion slot, so, you know, Gornado could also get, like, the use of his buff. And I thought that was very smart, so thank you for that comment. I do appreciate it. I could have got health, but you know what? It's okay. It's quite alright. This is just one battle. Looks like it. We went to a place very similar to this. I think it was in Valencia. Pretty sure it was in Valencia. Intruders, halt or be neutralized. Only I will be doing the neutralizing here today, good sir. Oh boy, should I set let's just summon one of those. Why not? <laughs> just for fun. Alright. Yeah, definitely just gonna charge right in here. I summoned a black tiger. That's interesting. That is very annoying. That little gear contraption right there. That is very loud. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna like turn down the sound effects on that, honestly. There we go, that's better. You're not going to be able to hear the battle as well, but... <laughs> I mean, jeez, dude, that... <laughs> Why did they make that so loud? Whoa! Okay. Ruher. <laughs> Got some tricks up his sleeve, I guess. wonder what world he's from. Actually, let's do that. And, yeah. Let's just take him out one by one. Why not? Alright, yeah, Mr. Miletus Modus is just getting absolutely destroyed right now. <laughs> Jesus, Peter. You're insane. You're insane, Peter. Oh my god. That's three in a row. My guy. Let's go, dude. Oh, that did poison on him. That's interesting. Uh oh, that's gonna do a lot. Jesus, 500? Oh my god. Okay, these guys can do some serious damage. You know, that that minion I just summoned is actually not bad. He's actually kind of helping out. Can I summon another one? <laughs> Should I just summon Mr. Pointy? I mean, what am I realistically gonna use those? I'm not really sure. Actually, it would probably be smart to go for the Musketeers back here. I think that's what I'm gonna do because, like... Actually, Barnabas, you can stay. You can stay, but I can't have them just, like, sitting back there and doing tons and tons of damage, you know? They gotta die, basically. They've gotta die. Come on, Garo, I'm counting on you. Get those chains in, man. They can't block. They're musketeers. Get them. Get them. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. 
Alright, yeah, he is really good. He is really good on uh, Musketeers. Definitely should keep that in mind. Okay, Peter, okay. Damn. Wait, so does Ruhr just like poison all of them? <laughs> when he whenever he hits, that's what it kind of seems like. Bleeding strikes. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, you're gonna need to die, and so are you. Actually, you attack you. There we go. More strength, it can never hurt, you know? Let's go, Peter. God, the music here, dude. It's so intense. Ah. Oh, come on. Finish him. Let's go. There you go, Barnabas. Someone else did the heavy lifting. Not that you always do the heavy lifting, Barnabas, because it's definitely not the case. But uh, anyways, let's blow this place up. Yeah! That'll show those stuff shirts who knows how to blow up a fortress. Let's get back to the Admiralty and get our commission then. All right, back to Captain Aubrey. I think I'll have to mark pretty close to him. Let's see, how far How far was this actually? Oh yeah, it was like right outside the city. All right. Let's see. Oh, sorry. Did not mean to intrude on your conversation there. My bad. Where are my manners? Where are my manners? Probably bone is very proper after all. All right. What are these photos? Just of Marleybone, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty nice. They're pretty nice. Giant greenhouse over there. Huh. Almost looks like the house of Miz. so soon. Blew up the hold, you say? Well, perhaps the service may have use for you after all. Go in. Okay. Admiral Kearns. Ooh, the war room. All right. We're in the big leagues now. Lots of loading. Lots and lots of loading. Look at this place, dude. Oh my god, this is so cool. This is actually so cool. Look at them strategizing and everything. Admiral Kearns. A commission? Balderdash. What do you think? We hand them out like biscuits? I mean, kind of. How could you n deny a level 52 such Come as I? Come for a commission, have you? Now hear this. The captains of the Royal Navy are the elite. The finest commanders in all the spiral. And what are you? A smuggler? A brawler? Do you think we have any need for your sword and Her Majesty's Navy? I would think. I think we need every boat so we can muster. So far, all our elite can do is lose. I like the look of this, Captain. Pirate or no? Proceed. I like this guy. Very well. The situation is deteriorating rapidly. The Valencian fleet has overwhelmed our forces, at least for the present. Worse, the clockworks have towed something into the Skyway. An armored station they're using to supply and repair their ships. Look here. The blasted thing's huge. Whoa. And so heavily armored that a bombardment by the entire fleet would barely make a dent in it. These artillery batteries here are the real threat. They're not working yet. But when they are, they'll have enough range to hit Marleybone City. Oh no, that'll affect Wiz. Imagine it. The <laughs> we can't have that. The will be able to pound Big Ben into rubble, and we'd be powerless to stop them if they can get the guns working. That's where you come in. We need you to dock at that station, force your way in, and disable the guns. Report to the dry docks and find Engineer Conrad. Hmm. She's an expert on clockwork engineering. She'll accompany you and assist with the sabotage. Any questions? Uh, no, sir. Hi. Are you out of your minds? One ship and one tiny crew against that? It's a suicide mission. If you're to be a captain in the Royal Navy, you'll have no end of <laughs> Marleybone expects every oh my captain God. will do their duty. Jesus. <laughs> Good hunting. Oh, that's a companion. Junior Engineer. Huh. 
I think she's pretty good too. Is that gonna level me up as well? Jeez, dude. Big XP from Marleybone. But anyways, we will get to that in the next episode. I really hope you guys did enjoy this one. Dude, I am just, I'm so excited just, just to question Marleybone. I've been having a lot of fun so far. God, I can already tell this is going to be a good time. But anyways, that's going to be it for this episode. Sorry it was a little bit shorter, but uh, Marleybone's kind of a short world, so I'd like to enjoy it as much as possible. Kind of just take it little by little, inch by inch. Anyways, though, that's going to be all for me, everybody. Make sure to leave a like if you did enjoy it on the video. It would really help out. I do appreciate it. And maybe drop a sub if you're looking forward to future content or, you know, enjoying the content that you just watched. It would mean the world. Anyways, in the next episode, it's pretty much Operation Save Marleybone City. So that's going to be... It's definitely very, very fun to carry out, but anyways, that's going to be all from me, everyone. I'll see you in the next video or stream, whenever that may be, so take care, enjoy the rest of your day, and peace out, guys.